Today we're going to cover the topic uh, Introduction to Pascal. For the purposes of these tutorials I'm going to be using Lazarus. If you have some other program that allows you to program in uh, Pascal language, it's alright, the code is identical. Uh, examples are Turo Pascal, Free Pascal and uh, many others. Uh, if you want to download Lazarus, go to Google, type Lazarus, just click on the first thing that comes. Downloads and uh, here you will see different types of Lazarus depending on your operating system. They are pretty much all 76.2 megabytes, so you should uh, be able to download them really, really fast. All right, let's open Lazarus now. Once you open Lazarus, you see four one and source editor. We don't need uh, any of these two for our purposes, so we go new, project, another project, double click on program. This is uh, the automatically generated code by Lazarus. Note that if you're using some other kind of uh, program for programming in Pascal language, like uh, through a Pascal or free Pascal, you won't get this code automatically generated. Furthermore, this code over here is uh, completely useless for the purposes of our tutorials, so just uh, I'm just gonna erase that so you don't get confused. Every Pascal program must have these three lines of code. So you have program project one, semicolon, begin, and end. Now, uh, program project one is obviously the name of our program, so project one is the name. We can change that to whatever we want. I'm gonna change it to Coca Cola now. Alright, now in between begin and end is uh, the code for our program. So let's implement a code to make the program write something out for us. So write hello YouTube semicolon. Now at the end of uh, more or less every command you have to put semicolon. Alright, now I'm going to demonstrate how to save our project. We go to File, Save As, I'm going to save it to my desktop now as Project 1. Let's go to my desktop to see what we got. Alright, so we got four icons. The first one is uh, well, just an image of the icon, which isn't of much help to us. The second one is the project, and uh, that's the important one. The third is also the project here, and the fourth is not important for now, don't pay attention to that. Uh, anyway, let's now run the program. We run it by clicking here, or going run, and run, or just uh, pressing F9 on our keyboards. Let's run it now. Alright, I don't know if you missed that, but uh, a command prompt actually appeared but uh, it didn't stick around, it vanished in like a half a second. So let's make it stay. We're gonna do this with a command read line, semicolon. Now uh, what this does is it, it makes uh, the program think we're gonna type something in for him to read and uh, that's why the command prompt stays open, as you can see. It wrote hello YouTube like it was supposed to. Uh, note, if you're using Turo Pascal or Pre-Pascal, you're gonna have to first compile the project and then you get to run it. Uh, Alright. I wanna take you back to my desktop now to show you something. So, three new icons appeared, as you can see. Lib, Project 1 and Backup. As for Lib and Backup, uh, those are not important to you at the moment. Just pay attention to Project 1. Project 1 is your program compiled and it's in exe form, which means it can be ran without any sort of program for Pascal programming. Alright, let's get back to our program. Now uh, I'm going to show you our command to write. It's called the uh, right line 
and uh, the command is write ln but this task is uh, write hello youtube in a single line so for example if uh, we had two things to write i'm gonna copy and paste the same thing now this will write it one below another while just using write as I'm gonna demonstrate now we'll write it one after another as you can see also note that uh, the commands don't have to be one below the other you can also just write the right after another as long as you got the semicolon it uh, won't make any difference see same thing nothing changed all right that completes this tutorial if you found the tutorial interesting and helpful subscribe to our channel and check out our website uh, the link is in the description below uh, and uh, you will find a lot more tutorials there anyway see you in the next tutorials